those of you who are wondering who this fella here is, I am the legendary Colonel Tom Parker. Colonel Tom Parker, legendary manager of Elvis Presley, has been rushed to Valley Hospital. I am the man who gave the world Elvis Presley. Without me, there would be no Elvis Presley. And yet, there are some who'd make me out to be the villain of this here story. Tom Parker was a liar, a cheat, a con man. A shocking new book accuses Colonel Tom Parker of massive fraud and mismanagement. Parker received as much as 50% of Elvis's income. He worked Elvis like a mule to support his own gambling addiction. The court finds that the compensation received by Colonel Parker is excessive and shocks the conscience of the court. Many believe that Colonel Tom Parker was responsible for the death of Elvis Presley. Now, you listen to me. The only thing that matters is that that man gets up on that stage tonight. Nothing all those muckrakers said in their books was true. Me and Elvis, we was partners. It was Elvis the showman and the colonel the snowman. I always knew I was destined for greatness. As an orphan, I ran away to the carnival, where I learned the art of the snow job, of emptying a rube's wallet while leaving them with nothing but a smile on their face. But the carnival act that would get you the most money, the most snow, had great costumes and a unique trick that gave the audience feelings they weren't sure they should enjoy. But they do. And I knew if I could find such an act, I could create the greatest show on Earth. After the carnival, I moved into the music business, the country music business. I partnered with one of its biggest stars, Hank Snow. Pardon me if I'm sentimental when you say goodbye. 
and his hapless son, Jimmy Rogers Snow. <laughs> Hot diggity dog, Billy, I got one. Oh, yeah. Can't believe it. Load their socks off. Security, security, Diskin. Tell the mayors of these towns that we need a police escort for Hank when he arrives. In Baton Rouge, we are going to have a carny wedding at the top of the Ferris wheel, so Zena, pick out your next husband. In New Orleans, we're going to use the loudspeaker to announce you, Hank. Oh, sure. And for you, Mazai Lazito presents, you are going to march in a parade. Bizarre! The sheets. Am I going to be riding on an elephant, too? A man on an elephant looks important. He's taller. We still need to get a novelty act to bring in the young folk. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That's why you have a meeting with the Duke of Paducah tonight. If we can book the funniest mouth in the South, we'll have the greatest show hey, of Jimmy, the season. Jimmy, turn that racket off. Y'all have to hear this. Kids all over town are playing it everywhere I go. I hear Negro rhythms, but with a country flavor. Sun Records, that's uh, Sam Phillips's label. Oh, yeah, Phillips. He makes all those race records with the colored singers. Well, this fella's on the hayride tonight. After me and the newcomer spot. In Shreveport? <laughs> no, they are not putting a colored boy on the hayride. That's a thing. He's white. He's... He's white? What do you think, Tex Arcana? Shall we play for the 27th time? Hey, 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 hey. But it don't matter if you do ten stupid things, as long as you do one smart one. Welcome, y'all, to the Louisiana Hayride, broadcasting live to 26 of these United States. How do you think I feel? I know your love's not real. Well, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Where is the kernel? You, you have the, the fella that's singing the All Right Mama, that new record that's on the Sun label, huh? The pop jocks keep playing him. Yeah. Country DJs, too. Even the colored kids, they're buying his record. The colored kids? Well, where would I find such an act? The dressing room. Oh, howdy. Hey, Ellis Presley, Boom Boom Boys. Yeah, come next. Excuse me. Go time. I know. I know. Hi. How's his stomach? I saw to grab him a Pepsi, but poor thing's still shaking like a leaf. I'll get him on the stage. Come on. Let's go. Here. It'll settle your stomach. What if I forget the words on live radio? All we gotta do out there is just a bit of clowning around. That's how we got this thing started in the first place. Scotty and Bill are right, Elvis. You're not out there on your own. You boys are a band. That's right. The Lord gave us music to bring people together. We're like a family, and family is the most important thing of all. Amen. Come on now, booby. Jesse's shining bright tonight, shining down his strength upon you. Jesse, Elvis' his twin brother, who died at birth. Tragic. Vernon, come quick. It's another trial. My darling, you'll have the strength of two men. <laughs> 